I don't, I mean, I don't know. It's hard to put into words, like, exactly, like, what you learn from a camp like this. I'm gonna try that, all right? Hydrating many small children. I'm Max King, co-camp director, along with Carrie. Um, uh, that's about it. The goal was basically to get kids who are passionate about running, passionate about trail running, um, that don't always have that opportunity to get out here, show them what trail running is all about, um, connect them with nature a little bit more, um, and just and put them through some, some hard work. like kind of that ridge line up top up there that you see in the far background. I'm gonna run up across that. It's very rocky. You never know what you're gonna see next. You get to see animals and explore new places and have awesome views that most people never see. When I talked to Max, he told me this, this camp was gonna be unique. Solomon wanted to bring uh, some youth that maybe would never get a chance to come out and do something like this. And uh, I, I can connect a lot to that just because of, of um, my past and um, the, the people I grew up with and just like my, you know, my family had to work super hard to, to get to where they are today. And so um, I just thought that was such a cool thing. I live in a trailer park. So, I mean, I don't really live, you know, in a big house. I live in a really small area, so, and it's, it's pretty difficult. With a lot that goes on with gangs and stuff. So, like, uh, sometimes my only exit is to go out in nature and have fun. And here, you know, right outside our cabin is a trail, so that's, we're really lucky to have a, such a beautiful place, and we cherish it a lot. The harsh part was definitely the 17 mile run hike we did on the PCT. Uh, we're starting our trek. All we know is that it's roughly 15 to 20 miles and knowing uh, max, it could be, could be anything. <laughs> it's to get from point A to point B um, and being able to go from one point to another point using just your own two feet. You, you finish a big run like that, You've basically done it under your own power um, without any support from anybody else. I think it gives you a great sense of accomplishment um, and a greater understanding of yourself and just the ability to see kind of what you're capable of. And that's really cool. This is going to be all day just hiking and running. It's like Lord of the Rings, but in America. Very beautiful but we might be kind of hurting. Well, it was my first uh, long run like um, on a mountainside. The sun was beating down on you and is just a really long uphill. But I mean, it was the hardest part, but um, it wasn't really uh, miserable. Like the beauty and like the breeze and all that, and just being up there. Uh, kept her mind somewhere else and didn't really pay attention to the pain. A lot of steepness, elevation, gets me tired. Gotta walk for a bit. You know, not many people get to experience this type of stuff. Not many kids, nor adults. in the city, there's a lot of cars, there's people. So it's really noisy, it's hard for you to concentrate. But out here is quiet. It's 
peaceful. You know, it's the nature is it's like medicine. Hanging out with youth, like you definitely remember just that that joy, like just when you're discovering something. Oh, that that almost looks good. <laughs> Run. Run. <laughs> People bond like when they're out there doing something together like this like we saw how in one day after a run like everyone all of a sudden was like we're like a family you know it's so, it's so cool like like you're bringing people from all aspects of life people that have had so many different journeys and from so many different cultures but yet you come to one place and you do a, a, this journey together that tests you and you suffer together and then all of a sudden you're, you're like close, you're, you're bonded. Oh no, this video. Okay. Hi. I'm like going through a few days or a week of hard work with a group of like-minded people. It kind of builds your character, builds on your character. They're not just out there running, but has a deeper meaning and a deeper impact on their entire lives. Trail running does not stop at the trails. We were so high up and the colors were all beautiful, like, reflecting off of people's faces and the smiles and remembering how it felt like we could go back to that run anytime that we wanted after we finished it. So, I mean, that's what's beautiful about trail running. You'll never know where you're going to go or you'll end up in places you can't even imagine to places where you thought you were never going to go.